Hi, welcome to Scale Model Kit Review. I'm Steve. Well, I'm going to go ahead and do my uh, do the Chevy Cheeseburger Challenge, which was uh, show you uh, a model that I built. Uh, what it is is uh, go ahead and show the oldest model that you may still have in possession that you built. And uh, I had to do some digging around. I actually had um, this mod these models in a box in my uh, garage here in Tucson and we've lived in this house for about 11 years and you can know you can imagine how hot it gets um, out there so I pulled the box out and I have numerous numerous kits out, out there I do have a few uh, armor kits but I figured I would just go ahead and go with the oldest one which I believe is, is the automobile car kits that I built. I built this um, over 30 years ago. Okay, And uh, when I looked at it, it brought back some memories. So, you know, to keep not to keep you waiting any longer, I'll go ahead and show you what it is. There it is. I think it's an old MPC Trans Am, and uh, it it was actually I built it once, and then I decided I wanted to make it like a stock car, a race car. So I sanded off the door lines and put a window net in it, and and I brush looks like I brush painted it. Um, I'll go ahead and turn on the little carousel here. It's kind of loud, but uh, definitely it's a glue bomb. You can see there's some melted areas on it. I hand painted the pinstripes. Oh yeah, baby. Yeah, it really jumps at you. It really blings, doesn't it? Yeah. Look at that Trans Am. It's just freaking awesome. Or fracking awesome, right? Um, but anyway, I had fun with it. You know, at the time, this was something fun for me. I wanted to, I liked race cars. I was big into them. And this is what I did. You know, look at my custom exhaust I put on this bad boy, you know. Um, look at look at them meaty tires. It's just it just you know wants to tell you I'm a race car. I'm a race car. But anyway, um, here it is. Here's the the oldest car kit that that I found you know in my stash. Um, I do have a few armor kits, like I said, that I built way back when too. But uh, I think this is the oldest one. Take the hood off. And look at look at the detail on that engine. It's just awesome. It just jumps at you. And then look at the detail on the inside. I, you know, I didn't even dust this thing. It's been sitting in a box. So I believe it's an old 3-in-1 MPC kit, but I may be wrong. It may be an AMT kit. I'm not sure. If any of you know specifically which kit this is, please uh, put in the comments below to let me know. Because I'm curious. I would love to get another one and build it. Uh, but uh, you can see no more door panel lines it's all been smoothed out and you know my custom pinstriping of course um, you know anyway it was fun to build all right go ahead and turn this off here um, with that Chevy cheeseburger challenge was for me to show you um, one of the oldest builds that I had and it was kind of fun because I, when I went out in the garage and pulled this box out I'm like holy smokes I forgot I even had some of these kits I mean I've got I've got a German half track out there I've got an SAS Jeep I built I got a Sturmke Schultz uh, 3 a Sturmke Schultz 4 I've got uh, an 88 millimeter um, what do you call it cannon or gun, German 88 millimeter gun. Uh, I've got an old British ambulance from World War II. All the decals are peeling off of it. I've got a Smokey and the Bandit uh, Trans Am. I've got a later model Trans Am. A later model Camaro. I've got a Porsche 959. Uh, a bunch of little small 135th scale military motorcycles. A um, couple of Volkswagen kits that I built. I don't even remember what who made the kits, but uh, one's 
convertible or that one's a hard top. Um, it was fun. It was really fun finding these kits. So I appreciate uh, Chevy Cheeseburger for you offering up this challenge. It made me go out in the garage and pull this box out and recover some of these kits. I got them out in my display cabinet now. They're, they're kind of, you know, they're hurting. And I'll probably look at uh, doing some restoration builds right here on my channel for you to check them out to see what I've actually what I, what I actually did in the past. But anyway, um, yeah, you see that sign up there? My uh, my wife made me take it out of the garage, so it's in my office now or in my in my hobby room. Um, I think that's a pretty cool sign actually. But uh, anyway, with that, I want to see everybody else's older builds and step up to the Chevy Cheeseburger Challenge, y'all, and uh, come back and visit my channel. Please subscribe. Happy modeling, everyone.